Hello, and welcome back to Chicken for Breakfast, the podcast where we have all the answers to one very simple question. What's cooking? I'm Magic. I'm Max. And on today's episode, we're talking about some awards. Mm-hmm. We're talking about some music and whatever else we get into. So make sure you uh, like and subscribe. Make sure you check out a video from last week, the uh, Max Learning Disc Golf video. Yeah, that's that's going to be up here. That was pretty fun, by the way. It was I pretty enjoyed, fun. I enjoyed that. You're pretty good at it. Thank you. Like, you're decent. I took frisbee in gym class my sophomore year, and I said, I'll just throw it like I threw a frisbee. It didn't go well sometimes, but it worked. Yes, sir. But uh, if you haven't seen it, go check it out. We want to start dropping more disc golf content eventually. And uh, without further ado, let's get right into it. What's up, man? What's going on? Homie totally left his key sitting right there. I did. But, uh, <laughs> it's all right, man. No worries. Hey, how you been? You haven't been on the podcast in a while. I haven't. How do you feel? Feels good to be home. <laughs> how you been? Good. How things with you, man? You, you have a story? You want to elaborate on good? Good's not really like I an mean, answer. I've just, I've been working a lot, you know? I've been... This is this is going great. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, so we've done a, a few videos without Max now, and they've probably been the best videos we've ever. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, it's good to have you back. It's good to be back. Uh, yeah, man. How are things with you, Magic? I feel like no one asks. No one ever asks. It's okay. Man, I've been working a lot. Life is pretty stressful right now, but uh, we're making it. We're making content, we're making good decisions, making making decent content, we're chilling. So, speaking of content, we have a few updates for you. We got some, we got some fun things coming. Number one, we've got a movie review coming out next Friday. Okay. Next Friday, not, not this Friday, next Friday. This Friday, I don't know what we're doing, but we'll give you something. Uh, so next Friday, we'll have a movie review. We went and saw, Ant- well, we didn't. We went and saw Ant-Man Quantumania. And uh, did a booth review on it, so there's that for you. And uh, what else? What else we got coming? Uh, we got another sports battle incoming. Which one? Do you want to? Do you want to give it away, or do you want to no, just let's wait? Not, let's, not, let's wait. Okay, we'll wait. Wait. Let's we've wait. got a solid sports battle coming in the near future here, so that might come out this this week. Yeah. So uh, maybe. But in all all seriousness, uh, let's let's hop right into this. So I was on TikTok this morning. And I saw Andrew Garfield giving a speech about Sally Field at the SAG Awards. Yeah. Uh, have you seen that? You know what I'm talking about? I know who Sally Field and Andrew Garfield is. I did not hear or see the speech. It was a solid speech. I mean, she's like, she's like, I think she's like 70. She's in her 70s now, I yeah. think. But, like, she's such an iconic character. Yeah. She's such an iconic actor. She's... She's, she, she puts the legend in legendary. Yeah. Let me tell you. Okay. Um, my experiences with Sally Field, uh, and I know I might get some hate in the comments for this, right? But, oh, there it is. Dang. There it is. Another yawn. That's number nine. Nine or ten now. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. Uh, we didn't have any of those in the last episode. Yeah. Or the episode before that. Or the episode before that. Or the one. No, it was the one before that. No. Yeah. Because it was three in a row without me. Ha <laughs> nerd. I don't like Anyways, <laughs> I don't, you know what? <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not really having a good time right now. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> but no, uh, so Sally Field, I know her best from one of my favorite favorite movies as a kid, Smokey and the Bandit. Yeah. It was a good, it's a good movie. Right. It's a great movie. Yeah. Solid movie. Should not be as good as it is. Right. But it is. Second one's not great. Our sequel's ever great. Yes. Some. Not all. Let me rack your brain for a second. Is Age of Ultron better than the first Avengers? Is Infinity War better than Age of Ultron? Is Endgame not better? Because it's Marvel. What does that mean? All right, I'll give you one. I'll give you one better. Which sequel is better, Shrek Two or Madagascar Two? Dude, Madagascar Two slaps. That was the best one. Third one, not so much. What? Third one, terrible. Europe's Most Wanted? Yeah, terrible. Horrid. Horrid movie. Huh. But number two, fine. Shrek 1 or Shrek 2? You know, I'm actually a Shrek 2 kind of guy. 
Right. But I, I enjoy Shrek 3 as well. Shrek 3 is a good one. Shrek 3 is alright. It's mid. Shrek 4. Shrek 4, though. That's a good one. Shrek 5? Coming out soon? <laughs> Shrek 5? Okay. Coming out soon. I'm really hyped. I am. I'm really excited about it. And since is this it? is chicken for breakfast in the morning, I'm making waffles. In the morning? I'm making waffles. Dude, imagine when Shrek 5 comes out. We're just sitting there in the morning eating chicken and waffles, watching Shrek 5, dude. That sounds like a solid idea. That does. That sounds like a hot... That sounds like a... A hot? That sounds like a... A thing. That sounds like a thing to do. <laughs> what are you doing? I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, so... Uh... Let's cut to a quick commercial break here. Yeah. I bet you weren't expecting a commercial break this episode. Exactly, no one ever does. So we want to start making some, some funny little commercial bits or some real commercials if you would know. If you give us some sponsors. Yeah. That'd be pretty cool. Start watching. Chicken for Break podcast. Every Wednesday and Friday on YouTube, Anchor, Spotify, Castbox, Breakers, Apple Podcasts. Are we on all these anymore? I don't know. I don't you know. can find us on Twitter and Instagram. Now. Definitely check out our link tree in the description below if you want to know the easiest ways to find us. I mean, we've got a Facebook page. What? We've got an Instagram page. And Twitter. Dude, we have a freaking Twitter. And you know who runs the Twitter? Elon Musk. <laughs> no, that's me. <laughs> this guy. Me. <laughs> this guy. Probably one of that guy. But me! I run the Twitter. Everyone runs the Twitter. But real talk, man. Hey. Go check us out. Link in the description below. Link tree. Go ahead and follow us around. Uh, make sure you're subscribed if you haven't, you know, done that already. Watching our, this video. Can we get our percentages up there? No. Chicken for breakfast, just you and me. Welcome back, Max. Nice. <laughs> like, like, wouldn't that be like a solid jingle? Ooh. Funny story. Actually, this is a really funny story. You're gonna like this. So All right. When we first created the Chicken for Breakfast podcast, right? Right. Everyone knows Darian was on it. Uh, Jax was on it. Uh, we were sitting in a studio, and I was talking about making the intro music. Oh my gosh. Are you bored? No. Are you bored? Yes, I'm not breathing enough. <laughs> so, we were talking about making the music, and actually the music that we use for the podcast, like the intro, mm -hmm. like the doom, doom, the, the music for yeah. this podcast, I made. Yeah. I made that music. I'm, I'm wow. very happy with it. I'm very proud of it. But before we did that, Darian and I made a little, a little jingle. Right. And I'm gonna try to find it. If I can find it, I'm gonna put a clip in right here. All right, so don't worry right. about mine. Here we go. Here we uh -huh. go. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. Chicken for breakfast is just you and me. Got your pancakes, got your coffee. You know you be missing me. You know you be missing me. Of that. Uh -huh. But it was so funny because it was like, chicken for breakfast, just you and me. Got your pancakes, your It was like, it was solid, it was lit, it was so cool. I think we're gonna have to remake it now. That would be cool. We're gonna remake it. Anyways, I thought that story was gonna be way more funny than it was. It, it but was in the making of Chicken for Breakfast, we had, we had some trials and tribulations. Yeah. And the music was definitely one of them. And the music that we have now, though, the do, it's fire. It is fire. Shout out to me. <laughs> I run the Twitter. <laughs> That's awesome. Don't forget that. Oh, let's get back into this whole thing. So, uh, Sally Field, what a gem. Honestly, what a gem. Yeah. Uh, I know she was the mom in Forrest Gump. Yep. Never seen Forrest Gump. Yeah. I started it. Two minutes in, I got distracted, had to do something. Actually, no. You know what it was? My parents, my parents were over, and I started watching it, and I think they had to leave. And when they left, I was like, well, I'll watch something else. And then I just turned it off. So that's even Disrespect. worse. That's even worse even worse but i'm gonna watch it for sure and you said she was modernly in something uh she is in a new movie called 80 for brady 80 for brady so it's uh is she 80 yet i don't know that'd be ironic it's um i think she's like 72 three other no other, she can't be 70 three three friends of hers who are also actors are in it and they're diehard new england patriots fans and they want to go to the super bowl because tom brady and the patriots went to the super bowl and they get the luck of meeting Tom Brady. At That's one awesome. Point, I believe. That's awesome. 
Well, I feel like, and I don't know if this is like an inaccurate thing to say, but I feel like celebrities always get like luckier. Like, you know, like they've got those connections. Right. You know what I mean? They always do. Yeah. Like me, like I can meet famous people. Name one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can meet, um, actually, I have met a couple of cool people. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, they've all been on TV and news. In local area. In the good old Ohio. Ohio. Aha! We really haven't met any, like... So, I mean... When I was in Scout, our Scout Troop met ACDC, but I don't know where that photo went. You met ACDC? Yeah. Huh. Is that cool? That is cool. That is cool. You thought I wasn't cool. You know, fun fact, I was in a... Summer... Or spring break my sophomore year of high school, I went to L.A. And we were getting a flight to Seattle. I had a poster, and I actually hit somebody behind me. I turned around, and there's Joe Montana. Yo. It looked exactly like him. I'm like... Was it really him? He had a ring on. I'm like... Wait, was it really him? It, I think it was. Cause why you think we, it was, so you don't know. No, but, like, he had a ring, and it had, a, like, a giant diamond in it. Yo. And back then, Super Bowl rings were not as big as they are. They were just either gold or silver. Yo, that's nice. And they had a giant diamond in it. That's really cool. Like, I was like... I was shocked. Like, maybe it was like... Maybe it was like... Have you ever seen those tribute people on, like, social media and stuff? Mm-hmm. Like, there was, a, there was a chick who went on... I think it was X Factor. There was a lady who went on X Factor as pink. And then, mm-hmm. like, she sounded not great. Right? Uh, she didn't oh, do, I remember she that. She didn't do great. That. And then she blamed the judges. And she was like, you guys are the ones who told me to come out here as pink or whatever. I didn't want to do that. And they're like, whoa... Whoa, we never said that. Like, that's not how this show works. Anyways, we're taking it off. Um, anyways, 80s with Brady, Sally Field. Huh? She deserves it. That's all I'm getting at. She deserves she it. Does. I mean, she's had a lot in her career. I think she's... I think the stats... I might be wrong, but I think she's had three Emmys. Yeah. She's had, like, three Emmys, two Oscars. Mm-hmm. Or I think it's the other... She's had three Oscars, two Emmys. And it, it, she's just amazing. Andrew Garfield, such a gem. Their relationship is, like, pretty solid was as well. Was she in the Spider-Mans? I think she was in the third Spider-Man. She had to be in the... With Andrew Garfield? Yeah. I think she was in the third one. There was only two with him. No, they all have a trilogy. No. He got number one, where he fought uh, Dr. Connors, the lizard. And then in the second one, he fought uh, Rhino... Are you sure there's not a third one? Yeah. I think there's a third one. There's only two. I don't believe you. Yeah. Because I remember there was like, what was it? He was only supposed to, he wanted a third, but no one really wanted to make it. So oh. he was facing Elektra. What, who's, who's Jamie Foxx's character? I don't know. He's the lightning guy. I know. I just, I, I'm blanking. Yeah. Elektra, I think it was. Elect, 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 elect. So let's move into music really quick. Mm-hmm. Uh, I've been really changing up my music taste lately. Yeah. I've been feeling a lot more like lo fi y, uh, like more like chill, chill vibes. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's, it's really been like a, a whole like mind altering thing. Like I feel in a better place, right. you know? Sometimes yeah. that kind of music just puts you in a solid place. Mm-hmm. So I've been, I've been feeling better. I've been feeling like life is great. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's really good. Um, I don't know. How's your music been going? Country. Same old. Country. <laughs> uh, so some, some recent releases uh, on my release radar on the way over here uh, were uh, Kid Cudi and Shrillix. There's a song. Oh, shoot. It's called Something About Summertime. Forget what it is, but there's a, a cool Shrillix and Kid Cudi song. Mm-hmm. Uh, I believe there's another. Oh, Jack Johnson did one uh, with... Um, Man, I should come prepared for this conversation. I, I, that's on me, bro. Mm-hmm. That's on me. Uh, Jack Johnson did one with um, that one guy. It was a good song. Hey, that one guy. It's called Traffic of. It's called Traffic. Traffic in the Sky. Okay. I think is what it was called. It was a good. It was a good song. But yeah, man, just a whole bunch of oh, bite by Twenty Four K. Okay. Uh, that's a new song that was out. I don't know. I don't know how new these are. They just kind of pop up on on my release radar yeah. when like. When they're convenient for me. Uh, yeah, no Nick D. No Nick D. Man, we haven't talked about Nick D for so long. What is your issue? I don't know. 
You just, you just, you're just that guy. You just always have to have something to complain about. You're like everyone else in the, the world, dude. What? He's the only thing I complain about. If you're, I don't know about that. I don't know about that. You're telling me out of everything in the world that you could, dude. Out of everything in the world that you could complain about, you choose Nick D. Okay. I don't agree. I don't. I don't appreciate. I don't respect. But it's okay. I'll let you have your opinion because this is America. Don't catch me tripping up. Nice. Nice. Nice reference. All right. Last. Last order of business here. Last order of business. Let's do. Marvel characters. Right, you didn't know this was coming. No. You didn't know this was coming. I can tell by the look on your face you didn't know this was coming. No. Alright, so check this out. Sixty seconds to guess. So you'll wanna you'll wanna pull up a All timer. Right. You'll have sixty seconds to guess this Marvel character that I'm thinking of. You can ask as many questions as you want. Mm-hmm. Well, let me set it. You can ask as many questions as you want and you have to get the correct version of them. I don't wanna I'm not gonna get super crazy with it and be like Oh, Andrew Garfield, second movie, Spider-Man. Like, I'm not going to be that specific, mm-hmm. right? But this is a nice little trial run of this game. I've seen it all over TikTok. Yeah. So let's do it. I'm going to think of one. Okay, I got it. I got my character. All right. It's entire MCU. Okay. All right. Let me, let me have the timer so it's not. All right, are you ready? Yeah. Three. Two, can we get the timer on the screen as well? One. All right, uh, Avengers. Uh, be more specific. Uh, like OG Avengers, like no. the first movie. Uh, S- Infinity War Avengers. No. Uh, Endgame Avengers. No, not an Avenger. Not an Avenger. Ant-Man. Ant-Man is an Avenger. Wasp? No. Modoc. No. Uh, Ultron? No. Uh, Thanos. You're terrible at this game. I know I am. You can't just start guessing characters. You have to like guess the. Um. Let's All right, see. We're, we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna give you some slack here. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna cut you some slack, and we're just gonna have you redo this round. I'm gonna give you an extra thirty seconds, dude. Okay, so one thirty. No, 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 no. You already used thirty. Oh. But just add another minute. So a minute. You have to like. It's like twenty questions. You have to be specific, but also vague. Okay. You have to really go crazy. All right, let's restart the timer, please. Do you know how to play this game now? Are you solid? All right, let's go. Three, two, one. Phase one. Ooh, no. Phase two. No. Phase three. I think so. Hmm. That's like three, maybe four. It's definitely four. Um, show? No. Movie? Yes. Black Panther? No. Um, uh, WandaVision? No. Uh, Wanda? No. Um, 30 seconds. What the heck? Uh, is your mind like blank? Vigilante or? No. No? My, like, we know him from a past time no. or like new? New. Um, it's a movie? Yes. Uh, we're in phase five right now, correct? Yeah. Who was it? It was Korg. Oh my god. You think I was gonna go easy on you, bro? You think I was gonna give you just like Thor or something? Alright. Alright, let me show you how to, let me show you how this game is played. This is how we do it here on the Chicken for Breakfast podcast. Alright. You got a minute. I got 60 seconds. Alright, let's go. I got a good one. Alright. Three, two, one, go. Uh uh <laughs> Wow, now now I'm like struggling. Okay, uh hero? Yeah. Avenger. No. Not Avenger. Anti hero. No? Vigilante. Kinda. Side character. Yeah. Definitely side character. Uh like main? No. Not main side character? No. So like Guardians movie? Any Avengers movie? Are they in any Avengers he, movie? He, he, he's, in a, he's in a Guardians movie. He's in, in a Guardians and Avengers. He's in a Guardians and Avengers. Okay. Um, uh, is it... Is it... Uh, uh, 
Oh my gosh. He's in Guardians and Avengers. So it is a Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. So it's the it's the big guy. What's his name? It's the big guy. What's his name? Oh my gosh. Is it Rocket? No. Oh. It's not Rocket. Is it uh, Dr- uh, Drax? It's not Drax. Am I going to feel stupid when you tell me this? Howard the Duck. <laughs> no way. No way. How am I supposed to get that? Because he is in... Bro, he is in... Um, what is it? He is in uh, Guardians of the Galaxy. I know. He's, he's in Endgame. I know. I, di- I didn't see him in Guardians of the Galaxy. He is in I Guardi- didn't know he was in them. He is in the uh, Chambers in that one guy's place. Oh, 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 oh. I did see that. I did know that. Yeah. That, that was cheap, dude. Yeah. That was, that was dumb. Yeah. I gave you a he's chance. He's a character. I don't know. I knew him. If you were, I, I knew, sh- I knew, I knew him, but I wouldn't consider him a character. Because you said a, he was a hero. I said, like vigil anti. Kinda. No, no, no. You said not. You said kinda. Yeah, but like. Yeah, 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 yeah. You gave terrible hints too. Like, cause like, how is he a hero? Like, he just shows up. Like, should I say villain? Like, I don't know what he is. Then you say no. No, he's not a hero. No, he's not a vigil anti. You didn't even talk into the mic. <laughs> No. <laughs> All right. Well, on that note, I think we're going to knock it off right here. Yeah. Any Anything you want to talk about? I'm Any okay. final words, Maxwell? Okay. I called you Maxwell. How do you feel? How you feeling, magician? <laughs> it's like the long form of the word. Yeah. Magica man. Magica man. Magica. I'm feeling good, man. Yeah. yeah that was a solid episode. It was. All right. Well, if there are no further questions, this meeting is adjourned. I like chicken for breakfast. I like it too. (laughs) He said. I like chicken for breakfast. I do too. And at the end of the day, we hope you do too. See ya. Seems like a lot. Hang on. That seems like a lot of do twos. Yeah. Okay. I got it. Ready? Yeah, go ahead. I love chicken for breakfast. I do as well. At the end of the day, we hope you will too. See ya.